Russia lost almost 90% of its pre-invasion military in Ukraine. A declassified U.S. intelligence report estimates that the war in Ukraine has cost Russia 315,000 killed and wounded servicemen, or almost 90% of the personnel it had at the beginning of the full-scale invasion. Reuters reported this, citing a source familiar with the intelligence data. The report says that Moscow's losses in personnel and armored vehicles inflicted by the Ukrainian military have set back Russia's military modernization by 18 years. The source said that a recently declassified U.S. intelligence report estimates that Russia launched a full-scale invasion of Ukraine in February 2022 with 360,000 servicemen. Since then, as the report says, 315,000 Russian servicemen, or about 87% of the total number with which Russia started the war, have been killed or wounded. As the source reported, these losses have forced Russia to relax its recruitment standards and conscript convicts and elderly civilians for deployment in Ukraine. The scale of losses has forced Russia to take extraordinary measures to sustain its ability to fight. Russia declared a partial mobilization of 300,000 personnel in late 2022 and has relaxed standards to allow recruitment of convicts and older civilians, the assessment says. The Russian army has left 1,300 armored vehicles on the battlefield and is forced to reinforce these forces with T-62 tanks produced in the 1970s, the source said. In early December, the intelligence community of the British Ministry of Defense released a new estimate of Russian losses in the war in Ukraine. In the period from the 24th of February 2022 to November 2023, the report says the official forces of the Russian Ministry of Defense probably suffered losses of 180,000 to 240,000 wounded and about 50,000 killed. As of the 12th of December, the general staff of the armed forces of Ukraine estimated total Russian combat losses at around 340,650.